Oh, okay. Well, good morning, family and friends. Here we are, back on trail again. Just got dropped off by the shuttle. The whole group of us filled up the whole shuttle. Heading north. Before we get going, uh, I would appreciate it if you would hit the thumbs up button at the bottom of the screen. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Very much appreciated. Thank you. And here we are, entrance to the 100 mile wilderness. No, I don't have 10 days of supplies. Just after 10 o'clock, made three miles so far. Okay, it's about 10.30. I don't know the name of this pond or whatever it is, but About 12.30, this is uh, Wilson Falls. Hello. Well, after one o'clock, it's a little after three. I just came across this. Um, I personally found it more difficult than any of the other fours, just because it was slick rocks combined with current pushing on. Um, the trekking poles were vibrating. I thought I was going to. Fallen in a couple times. It was um, mid thigh deep there where I went through. There's, there's, so yeah, that's why I didn't go up there and try to get across. It's almost 3:30, and here's the railroad through the hundred mile wilderness. About 24. We're at the spur trail for the Wilson Valley Lean To. So we're going to stop at. Yeah, here's my uh, setup. We're at a, a abandoned logging road for a campsite. There's a couple of people here too. I guess it's a nice location because it's close to water. Okay. So let me do the end of the day wrap up. Um, yeah, I did 13 and a half miles, so we'll round it up to 14 for the day. Because um, we need to, well, one, the trail cooperated, the weather cooperated. So we made some better miles than we have recently. Um, we kind of need to because uh, getting a food drop on four days from now in the afternoon at Mary Jo Road at 60 miles into the 100 mile wilderness. So yeah, we gotta make miles. Um, the only thing that's coming up is uh, more, more river crossings, and we want to get those out of the way before the next rain, rainfall, because the rainfall swells the creeks and stuff, it makes it harder. It was, it was the, 
Some of the crossings in the last few days have been harder than I would like. I was the one today I felt like I was um, I was uncomfortable with, but I got through it without getting wet. I mean, without falling in. Uh, and I can't think of anything else. Well, oh uh, yeah, I'll mention the as I mentioned before, we're camp near a, what they call an old, old logging road but ATVs are using it and they just came like four or five just came through uh, just a little while ago I'm I'm in the woods because I've got my hammock but some other people camped right on the road and they were uh, bit, a little bit of a d distraction anyway uh, have a good night mm -hmm.